so what we're going to do now oh it's a 1066 country walk we're not doing that we have a little look around um, Pevensey village uh, the courthouse and the pub So here we are back at Pevensey Courthouse, which I've done paranormal investigations a couple of times here. The Courthouse and Gaul. There's been a courthouse and a Gaul here since Tudor times. It's not open today, which is a sh oh, yeah, oh, maybe it is, is it? No, it's not open. But um, we did a couple of paranormal investigations here back in the day. I think about 2009, 2010. And it's really interesting, a great little place. Love they call it Gaul Lane. Gaul Lane. Um, yeah, what I'll do, I'll link the video below, but I'll also clip in uh, a couple of clips here of Alan picking up on the original jailer from this time. Make of it what you will. This has got to be it. Something wrong. Actually, this feels more like an entrance into another cell. I keep getting drawn this way actually. Through the wall, or just. Yeah, as if there should be something else. Another cell. Okay. Something to feel that he's a prisoner actually. Let me show you. Feel that he, he's running or in charge, you know? Okay. And he, he, you know, say jailer, but, but that's more, you know? Okay. What Alan's saying, I can agree with, um, with the movement of this jailer or person coming forward in this directory. Okay, I'm going in this dark, dark cell all by myself. Can't see where I'm going at all. Sorry Mark, that was a little bit squiffy because I'm trying to see what I'm doing. Here's my bed. Okay. I'm sitting in this cell all by myself in the dark because I is well brave. No, I'm actually not. I'm a little bit nervous. James, if you're here, I've heard that you've been here before. Really like to meet you. By the way, circa seventeen hundred. So we're at St Nicholas Church in Pevensey just behind the courthouse, although the courthouse is actually around the wrong way. The back is actually the, originally the front, but St Nicholas Church, um, dedicated to St Nicholas, who was a patron saint of seafarers, and it's absolutely gorgeous.
the chancel is the original part of the building and it's pretty much unaltered in 800 years which you find oh thank you very much <laughs> which you do find a lot on these uh, downland churches what is the time two o'clock it's two o'clock lovely field beyond Remember what I was saying early on, the sea would have come only a few hundred yards uh, nearby, which was uh, corrected in the 1600s. This is a lovely church, yeah. St Nicholas is built in Eastbourne green sand and local flint and lots of mishmash of styles as I say before if you look here you can tell that's probably going back to the original church it's lovely both St Mary's is open and St Nicholas is open wonderful wonderful we're on a lot of walking trails. I imagine they open them up for people who are just walking just to stop off and um, chill out after a long walk around the South Downs. As... Um, Neil said recently to me when we were down in Avebury, he said, you're fascinated by churches, but you're not religious or spiritual. Don't like that word either, but hey. Um, but I like the history, the hub of the local communities, you know, and how people were easily, because um, they didn't know any better. I don't want to use the word brainwashed because that sounds really rude, but <laughs> um, brainwashed by religion. But whatever floats your boat. Oh, look at this. Yeah, you could easily fall over that. Health and safety, please, come on. Mr. Jesus. I won't climb the stairs. I don't think they probably want you to do that. <laughs> I don't know why there are only stairs, but um, there's a great big chain on it anyway, so I won't. As I said, we're on uh, one of the sink ports, and there is a um, a seal from the I think the 13th century in the courthouse, which I think I've got a video from or at least a picture from when we're doing the investigations there, um, which is really fascinating. Oh, it's so nice here, really is nice.
patron saint of seafarers. So I hope you enjoyed this little video. Please like, subscribe, and uh, now I'm going to head down to our uh, B&B for the next two nights. See you later.